I mean, yeah, I, I, I did definitely at, at the beginning. I, I was quite, quite an actor when I was young and actor. It was kind of the middle years where it was like, you know, I stopped really, stopped thinking of myself as an actor. I, I was definitely always dedicated to this project, but you know, it's just come full circle now, so. Yeah. Well, both of us are, um, when we first started talking about the DNA of this project, both of us were children of divorce and uh, both of us had this kind of like-mindedness of being shipped back and forth between father and mother. And uh, it, Often growing up, you're made to feel that uh, there's something wrong with that or that somehow your parents' inability to have a perfect uh, union is representative of you being from a failed marriage or the product of a broken home or any of that kind of wording that is followed. And part of the idea for us was when we first started talking about I know Rick wanted to kind of honor parenthood and honor growing up. You know that the two together, before the whole before trilogy is a little, is about romantic love meeting time and boyhood was, was family love and its relationship to time. And they're, they're kind of two sibling projects in Rick's mind. And um, I don't know, does that answer your question? Uh, a film like this, which is such, you know, such a small, intimate, intimate film, that uh, the fact that it got made, that it, you know, it took all that time and, it, and everything came to fruition and that we're standing here is just a testament to, you know, people would like to see those stories and I hope that uh, in some way this encourages more films, small films, to, to uh, people to take a risk on it and take, take that challenge on.